Now we are on question number eight, which is nothing but the converse of the uh, the previous question number seven. It says using BPT, we have to prove that a line joining the midpoints of any two sides of a triangle right, is, uh, is uh, parallel to the third side. So first let's make a triangle. I'm making a triangle here. So let's this be a triangle and I named it say ABC. And there are two points given that is, uh, these are the midpoints of the other two sides. As you can see, I'm taking the midpoints of the two other side and I say named it as a D and this being E. Further, it says that line joining these two points, this one, All right? So what we know here that uh, this is equal to this, that is AD is equal to BD. Also, we know that AE is equal to EC. And what we have to prove here is D is parallel to BC, but by using using converse of BPT, we cannot apply any midpoint or other theorem. So let's first consider the triangle, but before that, let's obtain the ratio first. What are the ratios here? Can I say that since, since uh, AD is equal to BD or say DB, right here, these two are equal as it is given, this is equal to this. So can I say if two, two uh, uh, parts are equal, then the ratio will be one, or maybe right, you can write one over one, right? This is a marking equation one. Similarly, we have uh, AE is equal to EC. Therefore, from the same reason, we can also say that AE over EC, right, is, uh, is equal to one over one. Now say this is equation two. Now, what else we can do from these two equations? So from these two equations, first before that, let's consider triangle. We are talking about triangle A, B, C, and from one and two, from equation one and two, what we can say that AD over BD is equal to AE over EC. I've written from there, right? Because these two ratio is equal to one, the ratio of this is also equal, so they can be equated. And now, as you know that uh, in a triangle, if uh, a line divides the two sides in the same ratio, that is this over this, if it is equal to this over this, then we can say that the line DE will be parallel. So simply say that by converse of BPT, by converse of BPT, we can say that this line DE is parallel to BC. 